Hello guys, good morning. In this vlog, I'll be telling you about how to book your rooms in Mayapur Iskon Dam. If you haven't booked it online, there are options for on-spot booking also. In this vlog, I'll be covering up on that aspect so that you won't have any problem if you visit Mayapur. We had booked for three nights in Ishudayan Bhavan. Uh, that was through the online booking portal. For one night, we didn't get a vacancy in Ishudayan Bhavan. So for one night, we had to sort it out in Mayapur itself. Uh, first night, we stayed in Ishudayan Bhavan. And the second night, uh, we had to figure things out. So me and Appa, we asked uh, someone. He told us to book in Gada Bhavan area. Behind Gada Bhavan, there is a place for on-spot booking. Uh, the person who was out there, he told us to come the next morning. We went there next morning but the place was already full. The person who was in charge told us to go to Nityananda Kuti. Me and Appa, we carried our luggage and we headed off to Nityananda Kuti. By God's grace, we met an acquaintance whom we had encountered during our morning up to Bushana. I am very thankful to Prabhuji. He told us to go to the place where he is currently staying in, that is Shruti Bhavan. Yeah, we went to Shruti Bhavan and he introduced us to the person out there and the person out there search for if there is any vacancy in Bhavan. There were two options. One option is for rupees 500 if you want uh, your own bathroom attached to your room. And the second option was sharing bathroom for rupees 250 per day. Thankfully we got one room. Uh, we had to use the shared bathroom. So Appa and I, we finally found a shelter for that day. You also have another option for on-spot booking that is Kauranga Kutir which you will find on your way to. Shruti Bhavan. So in this video, I will be giving you a brief tour of the room. This is for Rs. 250 per night. This is our room on the third floor, room number 303. Let's go inside. We have a double door. So yeah, this is our room. Appa slept on this bed and this is my bed. I did some editing at night. And we have a window. Window is also double. This one's with the net. And we have the glass window out here. Uh, this is my plazo which I bought on the market yesterday. Since there was a uh, downpour, the lower part of my plazo got wet. So I just washed it and dried it on the window. And this is the view from the window. We are also provided with table and chair, our luggage up here. Hello guys, hello, hello. We also have a fan to go up with the temperature. Inside the room, this is the view. You can sit on the chair and enjoy the view. This is the view, balcony view. Also have a space for drying clothes up here, which I didn't know. I just came across this right now and this is the view from the other balcony guys you can see these trees these trees are something which I'm seeing for the very first time uh, the body looks like that of the palm tree and the leaves are that of banana tree if you have any idea about this tree do let me know in the comment section it looks like hybrid to me okay guys that's it I'm grateful that we have a place to stay instead of not having a place to stay at all to count my blessings i hope you enjoyed this short guide and i'll be linking the places you can opt for on spot booking in my description box those are the places that i know of there might be more places if any one of you knows about more places you can comment on the comment section so that it will be of some help to others okay bye bye we are checking out uh, at 8 am and then we'll be heading off to ishida and Bhavan. i'll be doing room to official dining bowl i'll be giving you the idea about the process okay guys thank you for watching bye bye